Hello, today I will show you how to make a payment through active building. There are two ways you can do this over here. Um, you can choose make a payment on the quick links or you can go to dashboard payment center. So here you have the option to set up recurring payments. Um, if you have never made a payment on uh, active building, you will need to go to select a payment method. And down here, you'll need to choose add new payment account. We recommend that you do e-check, which will be through your checking, checking account. You'll need to enter in your information, including your routing number and account number, billing address, and then you would choose add bank account. So you have a couple options. You can set up a recurring payments. From here, you would schedule a new recurring payment. Again, once you set up your payment account, you will be able to choose the e-check. You can either pay off your current balance, uh, you can do a total amount or a fixed amount. And once you do this, then you would be able to submit it. Okay. If you want to um, do your current amount in a prepay, you can do that. Um, also, if you um, have set up a payment plan or you do not want to pay what the current amount is due, you can do an other amount, type that in, and then you will be able to make that payment. Okay. And then if you are wanting to do an e-money order, um, you would go to, you can go to pre, uh, print payment coupon, um, and then you would click on print payment coupon. You can also take a screenshot of it. There's a number on there that you would need. Um, if you're looking to see where you wanna make a payment, you click on here, open this in a new window, and then you would put in your zip code, however many miles away, type in this code, And then you will see uh, on the top, it'll show you locations in the same zip code and then within 10 miles. Um, if you are wanting to make a payment through Walmart, I would, make, I would call them first to see if they are accepting e-checks um, at the moment. Otherwise, I would still, before venturing out, call the store and to see if they are accepting the e-payments. All right, and that is how you pay your rent online. Thank you.